Hey everyone, welcome back to another video on Gizmo Rush. I'm Prakhar and today we have an exciting speed test showdown between Airdrop and Quickshare to see which one is truly faster. We'll be putting Samsung S23 FE and S23 Ultra head to head with Apple's iPhone 13 and iPhone 14 using a hefty 3GB video file to test their limits. But that's not all. We'll also extend the challenge to a MacBook and Windows laptop to see how well AirDrop and Quickshare perform across different devices. But before we get into the speed test, let's talk about what AirDrop and Quickshare are. AirDrop is Apple's proprietary file sharing feature which is available on iPhones, iPads and Macs. It uses Bluetooth and Wi-Fi for super fast and secure file transfer. Whereas Quickshare is Samsung's answer to AirDrop, which is a built-in file sharing feature for all Samsung devices. Also, due to the collaboration between Google and Samsung, Quickshare can be used by other Android phones. Let's start the file sharing test between Samsung Galaxy S23 FE and S23 Ultra. I have selected a 3GB video file which I will share from S23 FE phone to the S23 Ultra. Wow, it took only 28 seconds to transfer the file between these two flagship phones, which is pretty fast for transferring a 3GB file. Now, I'm putting the Apple's AirDrop to the test by sharing the same 3GB video file between iPhone 14 and iPhone 13. The goal is to see if AirDrop can set a personal record for file transfer speed. I have paired up these two iPhones and selected the video file which I'll be sending. Now, let's hit the share button and see just how quickly AirDrop can get the job done. Okay, it took 45.30 seconds, which is much longer compared to the Quickshare. As you can see, Quickshare only took 28 seconds to share the 3GB video file between these two Galaxy flagship smartphones. However, AirDrop failed to beat that Quickshare record and took 45.30 seconds to finish the file transfer. Sharing files from your phone to your PC or vice versa can be frustrating, especially if you have a loose data cable that gets disconnected with a slight movement. That's why I use Quickshare for a wireless transfer without any problem. It can easily send a big chunk of data at lightning speed. Then I thought, why not test the data sharing speed between Quickshare and AirDrop and see who gets to win. Let's kick things off with a Quickshare test between Samsung Galaxy S23 FE and a Windows laptop. I have chosen the Acer Nitro V15 which is powered by a 13 gen Intel i5 processor equipped with the latest Wi-Fi and Bluetooth drivers to ensure high data transfer speeds. You can learn more about this gaming laptop by hitting the i button. Now let's dive into the file sharing challenge. Now, as you can see, it took around 1 minute to finish the file transfer. Next, I'm going to reverse the process and send back the same file from the S23 FE to the Windows laptop to see if there's any change in speed.
Interestingly, the file transfer was a bit quicker this time, clocking at 52.81 seconds. Now let's shift the gears to the Apple's AirDrop. I am using a MacBook with the latest M3 Pro chip to send the same video file to the iPhone 13 and see how long it takes. Impressive, the airdrop finished the file transfer in just 42.44 seconds. Finally, I'm sending the file back from the iPhone 13 to the MacBook. This time, the transfer took only 39.19 seconds. Now, it's time to compare the results. AirDrop clearly outpaced QuickShare, snatching the victory by a significant margin. It's a decisive win for Apple in this speed showdown. And that's all for today. In this video, I have put AirDrop and QuickShare through a rigorous speed test across different devices. QuickShare dominated phone-to-phone -phone transfer between Samsung devices, whereas AirDrop excelled in Mac and iPhone pairing and transferring files. Whether you're Team Samsung or Team Apple, both of these tools offer lightning fast wireless file sharing. So which one do you prefer? Let me know in the comments below and watch these videos from our channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon to get regular updates from Gizborosh. Thanks for watching.